Iron Talk is brought to you by Case IH. The world of farming is changing. From the power and versatility of Steiger and Magnum tractors to the legendary reliability of axial flow combines, Case IH can help you be ready. To learn more, visit caseih.com forward slash be ready. We've been talking a lot about soil sampling on the show recently, and in today's Iron Talk, we're going to discuss how to manage those soil tests and where to pull them from this year and in the future. With all the technology in agriculture, especially when it comes to GPS equipment, one of the best uses for it is in soil sampling. What I'm talking about is repeatability. When you pull a soil sample this year, and then a few years later you decide, oh, I'm going to go back in that field and sample again, wouldn't it be nice to pull it right from the same spot? When you're right in that same area, you can judge how your fertility program is working over the years. If you're pulling it in different spots of the field, those tests really may not have much to do with each other. So one way you can do it is using your GPS handheld unit. Many of the new models of handheld GPS units allow you to mark spots in your field so you can repeat exactly where those samples are pulled next year. I'm not talking about sticking your probe down in the exact same hole that you did three or four years ago, but if you're within an inch or two, that's going to be very similar to the results you saw last time, and you can compare how your fertility program is working. So when it comes to soil sampling this fall, get yourself a GPS handheld unit you can mark where those spots are at so you have repeatability in the future. That's all for today's Iron Talk, and now back to the show.